Hello, this is an update for the Travel War tools. Um, well, it's kind of the same. You select here where you want to uh, play and then uh, press go and then you log in to your screen. And then um, this is what you get. This up here is the same as from the last one. On, up here you can hide this uh, panel here if you want to get a better view. Here you can add cities, just like this is, uh, the last one, just by right-clicking and then add a city. Then uh, type in the city name. And the way you get uh, the city name, uh, you get it from uh, when you select the city. You can just right-click here and uh, and you'll get it uh, right here. That's the city name. Yes, and then um, for each city up here, you can have... Uh, targets that you want to attack and um, now I changed this down here so you can um, you can uh, type in the coordinates of the city you want to attack put in light cavalry axemen spears and, and swords and uh, what city you want to attack to and and um, the interval it means uh, from when it's attacked then it has a certain uh, period that uh, the city is not going to be attacked again. That's uh, just how you set that down here. And that's the way you can do it by adding sinkholes. Um, I made another thing, uh, this button up here, where you can get cities. And this will open up uh, a new screen. So you go to, to the map. And up here you select which city you want to attack from. And uh, the period here. And then how many units here? Then all you do is just click, left click, city, and then press the city icon here. Then it will get added to the list down here. And you can just continue as many cities uh, as you want. And then when you you're done, all the cities down here, you just press this button up here, and it will add all the the targets here from that city with that interval and with those like cavalry it will add those to the list so that's a much faster way to add to the list also up here you can include in every attack that you do you can include a spy uh, if you have some um, and you can include uh, your your paladin if uh, if he is available and what's more yeah, I'm, I did uh, this when you start the timer up here. Uh, I colored all of the, the cities that are uh, not within the interval, uh, so they're not, not attackable. Uh, they are orange, and all the greens one, uh, green ones are the ones that are going to be attacked next if you get uh, soldiers here. And now you can uh, also move them up and down. Where you want to, if you want uh, the priorities from the top down, so you can move them up if you want to get a higher, higher attack rate. Um, yeah, and then uh, if you move it up and down, you can press save up here uh, to save the new list order. Um, also up here, if you press files, then this will open up a, a window here where the program is installed and here you can see all the targets uh, so you can uh, open this up with uh, with your notepad uh, in here is just all the targets so, so you can edit those or type in new values or whatever and uh, save them and then uh, when you s uh, save them you can reload them here so they get reloaded down here that's kind of the, all the new features. I took out a lot of uh, old features that are not that is not uh, so useful anymore. Yeah, and one more thing I added is uh, when you're running and you don't want when you get a lot of troops in and you don't want to wait until the interval has run out to send them out again, you can just press this update button here. This will trigger the auto update and then it will move them. Uh, all out again. Yeah.
and that's all the, the updates uh, and of course I fixed the one uh, where it couldn't press OK after you attack uh, I fixed that one so now it's working again and uh, yeah I added this uh, donate button also if if any of you want to donate I would appreciate it and then uh, I'll keep on adding new features the next feature I'll be looking at is adding um, uh, you know, the you know, like uh, creation of units to like a list so you don't have to go in and select them yourself and also buildings and stuff like that so you don't you're not limited to only having two building buildings in the building list so I'll extend that so you can have as many as you want but uh, that takes time and then uh, if you want it in your your tool you should donate anything you, that you that you want and when I get uh, 150 euros, then I will, will implement those two. Yes, well thank you for watching.